Okay, so let's chat brows. Filling in your brows. Um, it's something that can be super intimidating, but it doesn't have to be. And I'm gonna show you really quick the easiest way to do it. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is this is the hotline brush. Um, <laughs> so like your eyebrows are calling, they need help. This is the brow hotline, okay? So you have one end, this end right here is super firm. These bristles are super firm um, and they really pick up and put the color down in a really like you can pinpoint where the color goes um, and have a lot of control over where it goes. And then the other end is this bristle end that you can go ahead and blend everything out um, so that it can look as soft and as natural as you want. So in my compact, I have Trust Eyeshadow and I've been using the same tin of Trust Eyeshadow for at least two years. Like this brow kit that I'm gonna show you today will last you as long as you want it to last. Um, so this is trust, you see that gorgeous brown color and all the edges. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tap it in. I just popped that color out of my compact. I'm just gonna tap my brush into the tin and I'm gonna borrow my compact mirror. And all you're gonna do is come in here and accentuate that bottom arch line first. That's gonna give you a basis of where to put all the rest of your color and your whole brow shape. So just go in there and accentuate that bottom line. You're creating that beautiful brow structure, okay? Now, I've got the color on my brush to do that. Now what I'm gonna do is I don't wanna have Sharpie eyebrows, okay? So I have the majority of the color in that bottom arch. I had my brush flat while I did that. I was drawing that line. Now I'm gonna turn my brush where it's up and down. So it was this way. Now I'm turning it up and down and I'm gonna put the brush right at that bottom line and then flick up so that I can pull the color from that bottom line up into my eyebrow and it distributes that powder so that it looks nice and soft and natural but I'm still filling in all of my brows and it looks really natural. Do you see how easy that was? Isn't that awesome? So then I'm gonna flip my whole brush over to the other side and fan it out even more so that it looks really nice and natural. And then if I have any powder that comes up, I can just kind of clean it up with my fingers. And then when I go on to do my eyeshadow or my other face makeup, I can use my brush and come in here and clean up any areas that got a little powder. It only takes a second. You can go in there and clean that line up. Done, that's it, isn't that so easy? Let's do the other side and just go over it one more time. So, just gonna tap in, get a little bit of makeup. I definitely need my mirror for this part, okay? And I'm just gonna make that, this is the most important part, is making that bottom arch nice and smooth. You wanna have your arch, the point of your arch, be like this so you can borrow your brush, put your brush on the tip of your nose, line it up with your pupil where it hits, that should be the peak of your arch on your brow. So you wanna get that right. Make that big, beautiful arch. And then go in, turn our brush, flick that color up into your brow and distribute all that color. But it's nice and soft, not too much. And this is why that tiny little tin lasts you so long. And then you just flip your brush to the bristle side and brush it all out. It's so easy. Okay, so there's a couple different colors that will work when you're getting your custom brow kit. So if you're interested in trying the brows, just send me a message. We'll take a look at your hair color, your skin tone, and see what eyeshadow color would work best to fill in your brows, and then definitely get the hotline brush. All right, let me know if you guys have any questions.